Proverbs chapter 20. Wine is a scoffer, strong drink a brawler, and whoever is led astray by it is not wise. The dread of a sovereign is like the roaring of a lion. Whoever provokes him sins against his own life. For a man to cease from strife is esteem, but every fool bursts out. The lazy one does not plow after the autumn. At harvest time, he inquires, there is none. Counsel in the heart of man is like deep water, but a man of understanding draws it up. Most men proclaim each his own kindness, but who finds a trustworthy man? The righteous man walks in his integrity. His children are Baruch after him. A sovereign who sits on the throne of judgment is scattering all evil with his eyes, who says, I have cleansed my heart, I am purged of my sin. Differing weights and differing measures, both of them are an abomination to Yahuwah. Even a child is known by his deeds, whether his work is clear and right. The hearing ear and the seeing eye, Yahuwah has made both of them. Do not love sleep, lest you become poor. Open your eyes, be satisfied with bread. Evil, evil, cries the buyer. But when he has gone his way, then he boasts. There is gold and multitude of rubies, but the lips of knowledge are a precious vessel. Take the garment of one who is given tour for a stranger and hold it as a pledge when it is for foreigners. Bread gained by deceit might be sweet to a man, but afterward his mouth is filled with gravel. By counsel plans are established, and by wise guidance wage a battle. He who goes about as a slanderer reveals secrets. Therefore do not associate with him who speaks smoothly with his lips. Whoever curses his father or his mother, his lamp is put out in deep darkness. An inheritance obtained with greed at the beginning is not Baruch at the end. Do not say, I repay evil. Wait for Yahuwah and he saves you. Differing weights are an abomination to Yahuwah and a false scale is not good. The steps of a man are from Yahuwah. What does a man know about his own way? It is a snare for a man to say rashly, it is Kodesh, and only later to reconsider his vows. A wise sovereign winnows out the wicked and turns the wheel over them. The spirit of a man is the lamp of Yahuwah, searching all his inmost parts. Kindness and truth watch over the sovereign, and he shall support his throne by kindness. The calmliness of young men is their strength, and the splendor of old men is their gray hair. The blows that wound cleanse away evil and strokes the inner parts of the heart.